Hi guys, we've got Amelia with us today. She came to see me because what has been bothering her is her facial asymmetry. So especially she does notice that on her right cheeks where she has a bit of an indentation. So what I suggested to her is doing a correction or improvement of the facial, hemifacial asymmetry with derma filler. So I'm going to build up the right side of a zygomatic arch of her cheekbone with filler so that can match the left side. I'm also going to touch up slightly the left side to make sure she's got the most perfect symmetry. Hi, good evening, it's so nice to meet you. Thank you so much for coming. Um, so, is Amelia, isn't it? Yeah. Great. So, how can I help you? Um, I just have some asymmetry in my face, mm -hmm. mostly in my cheeks. Mm -hmm. No problem. And um, you never had any treatments and previously on your cheeks, right? Okay, not a problem. Great, so yes, yeah, so I can definitely help you and uh, that will be done with some derma fillers yeah so it's a temporary treatment that will last between six and twelve months and then we can repeat it if you like it um any questions mm -hmm. no amazing so, really? yeah. <laughs> okay so have a look yeah perfect cool yeah so the right side of your of your face is slightly shorter <laughs> Um, so the left side, so the, your, your cheekbone on the, on the left side is more curved and more pronounced. Mm -hmm. The one on the right side is a bit flatter. So what I'm going to try to do, and also when you move your muscle, when you smile, mm -hmm. there's a tiny dent that you can see on the right side. So what, what I'm trying to do with the Revaness outline is essentially uh, try to feel that dent, uh, which is where the ligament goes through and also uh, building the side of, of the cheekbone which is flat so I try to match the, the two areas so I'm gonna inject more on the right side to try to match the left one. Okay. Mm. Lay down and relax for me. So since we are improving the asymmetry of your mid face and of the cheekbones what I'm also noticing is a slight asymmetry between your brows so your right brow similarly to the cheekbone is a bit lower compared to the left side so what I can try to do with the toxin neurotoxin is improve that so what I'm planning to do is to essentially lift both brows especially the right the your right one to compensate that so if you frown from you're really angry so all of that can be done with Botox it lasts for about three months lift your brows up for me and smile for me as well you see, so the muscle that basically is called the orbicularis oculi is a muscle that is a circle around your eye. It's much more active on the right side. Mm -hmm. So when you smile, it closes down, it brings down the, the tail. Mm -hmm. While I was assessing her face, I also noticed that she had an asymmetry in her brow. So the right brow, the right eyelid was lower. So what I did suggest to her as well is to compensate, to try to correct that as well at the same time by using some neurotoxins and neuromodulators. So I did that as well. I lifted the right brow. I kept the left brow where it was. So she's gonna have a really good improvement also on her upper face. I'm really excited for her. Well done. Okay, and then I'm just going to lift, sorry, just a tiny bit of her and I'll just give you a nice lift there. Amazing! Brows lift has been done. Stay right there. And relax. Slide again. And relax. I feel just a gentle pressure. Well done. Lovely. You okay? Mm -hmm. Smile, shall we? And relax, stay right there. Smile again. And relax. Lovely. Yes. 
So in Amelia's case, I assessed her face and she had a very common hemifacial asymmetry. So we very, very few people are perfectly symmetrical. So we all have an asymmetry to a certain degree. In her case, it was slightly more obvious around her cheekbones and her brow. So all the right side was slightly lower, slightly deflated. The brow also was lower. The eyelid was a bit heavier. So I suggested instead of concentrating just on the cheekbone, which is the area that she picked up the most, to also help with the brow. So by contouring and building more the right side of her cheek and lifting the right brow, that's when you get more the heart shape. So the uh, asymmetry gets improved um, and hopefully corrected and also the, the eyes get also more open. So the combination of the two is, um, it looks really good. Ha, ha, ha.